Watch how easy it is to import a list for Call on the Go. First, make sure you're logging in with a computer using the Chrome browser. You just go to app.callonthego.com. Uh, you scroll down and go to the Import Contacts tab. Come up with a descriptive name like this and make sure you hit enter to submit it. Now you find a file on your computer. Just as an example, I'm just grabbing a generic file here. Now you grab the file and you already hit next and so it does take a few seconds depending on the the size of the file. Now what's happening here is Colin the Go is reading the file and you have to tell Colin the Go what columns to import uh, because the Colin the Go program can only display five categories or columns or fields whatever you want to call them so you're going to choose five columns and of course since it's all about making phone calls you're going to want to choose um, the phone number column as mandatory so i'm going to select this as the number column and everything else just really does not matter. Um, I mean, you could put the first name in the address column or whatever works. But basically, we're telling Colin the Go what to import and display for us. Okay, I'm just going to leave that blank. I'm going to call this the company column. And I'm just going to call this the notes column. So it is mandatory that you select five and exactly five fields to import. Otherwise, it just will not import for you. Okay, so it says the import was successful. Let's try to find our list. Okay, this is our list, may lead. So notice it. Uh, condenses everything to the five columns that we selected. Now keep in mind the first and last name column is is uh, consolidated here. So if you want to make changes, it's just like a spreadsheet. You just select a column to make, or I should say you select a cell to make a change. So that's how easy it is. And so this information will be displayed on your cell phone when you're going through the auto dialing. I hope that helps. Thanks.